Hi, I'm Benjamin, author of Master Math Models, and the purpose of this channel is to make math easy for kids to understand. So let's today work on the PSLE 2023 speed question based on memory recall. Let's go. The first thing to do in any question is to highlight the keywords. So let's begin to highlight the keywords now. The keywords are Pfizer and Elise started jogging from the same spot at the same time. Okay. Faisal's speed was 30 meters per minute faster than Elise. So what does this mean? It means that every minute that passes, Faisal will be 30 meters ahead of Elise. He will cover 30 extra meters every minute. Next. Both of them did not change their speed throughout the jog. Faisal jogged all the way to the end and then he immediately made a U-turn. So what happens now is that Faisal gets to the end and then he comes back, all right, in this direction. And what happens to Elise? Well, they will pass each other at the 4,000 meter mark on the track. So for Faisal, he takes the same amount of time to do this as it takes for Elise to do this. Okay, so these are the distances traveled by Faisal and Elise. Now, you can see here there's a 600 meter as given in the question. My question to you is, what is the difference or the extra distance traveled by Faisal? Let's see if you were right. What Faisal did was that he went and did this extra distance to reach the end, and then this extra distance to come back to meet Elise at the 4,000 meter mark. In other words, the two black arrows that I've just drawn here is the difference in the distance or the extra distance that Faisal covered. But the question is, how was Faisal able, able to travel an extra distance? The answer is that he was traveling faster. Remember that he's able to travel an extra 30 meters per minute. So all we need to know now is how much extra distance he traveled and we will know how long he took to travel that extra distance. Okay, so now let's find the difference in the distance, which is this portion. Okay, to find the extra distance covered by Faisal, all we have to do is find the two black lines here. How much is that? If your answer was 600 times 2, then you are perfectly right. Now, how was Faisal able to cover an extra 1,200 meters? Because every minute he covers 30 meters more. So what should we do next? If your answer was to take 1,200 meters, and divide this by the extra distance he covers every minute, you will get 40. And what is the units for this 40? The answer it is, is that it is 40 minutes, which is the time taken for Faisal to travel this extra distance. The next thing to ask yourself is, what do they have in common? Is it the distance traveled? Is it the speed they were traveling? Or was it the time they took to travel the distances that they traveled? The answer is that the time they took to travel, their distances is the same. So if Faisal took 40 minutes to travel an extra 1,200 meters, it also means that Faisal traveled 40 minutes. And since Faisal traveled 40 minutes, and Elise traveled for the same amount of time, then Elise also traveled for 40 minutes. So now we know that Elise's time taken to travel 4,000 meters is 40 minutes. To find Elise's speed, we need to use the formula for speed. So the formula for speed is the distance traveled divided by the time it took to travel that distance. 
So since we are finding elicit speed, then the distance traveled is 4,000 meters and she took 40 minutes. So we are going to use these two numbers. So this would be 4,000 divided by 40 minutes. And this working will give us 100 meters per minute. And that is Elisa's speed. If you found the explanation easy to understand, I would appreciate if you could leave a positive comment in the comment section, as it would help support the channel. Remember to subscribe to watch the other videos for 2023 PSLE Math, as well as the most difficult questions in the last few years. For free copies of this worksheet, please join the Telegram group found in the description below. I'll see you again.